Hello, hello, and welcome to Healthy Life with Kimmy. Well, hey guys, today we are on day number 29 of the challenge. We are almost done, day 29. And today I'm talking about read the nutritional labels. We must learn to read the labels, okay? So I'm gonna go through one with you really quick. A lot of times we just eat things because we like it. We don't take time to read. We are not a nation of readers like we should be. I'm included so I can talk. But today I'm gonna to show you, for example, this peanut butter, okay? I'm gonna show you this peanut butter. So we're gonna flip the camera and we're gonna look at the label for a moment and then I'll come back and talk about it. So you see this label here? It's 35 servings in this peanut butter. This jar of peanut butter has 35 servings. And we've had it for a minute. And I'm gonna tell you, we have not gotten 35 servings. We've probably gotten 15. <laughs> that is too much peanut butter. So as you can see here though, Two tablespoons is 200 calories. Two tablespoons. Now, let's see. Can I get my tablespoon out? Hold on. Let me see. Can I show you? Look at this junky drawer. Go Lions. Go Lions. Let me see. Here's my little spoon thing. Let me find. So, this is this. Two. Let me show you. That's two tablespoons. You see that? That's two tablespoons. Where's it at? Tablespoons. That's two. All right. Now let's go back to the peanut butter. This is just one example. If you do this in your whole kitchen, you will see that we probably are consuming too many calories, right? So that's two tablespoons. That little bit amount is 200. Do you put more on your, um, probably, probably, you probably do. So the next thing that it says was 16 grams of fat in those two little tablespoons. So imagine if you are having two, four, six, let's say eight tablespoons, which is probably what the average person put on a sandwich, times 16 for math sake, for math sake, we'll do 20. So that's 80 fat, okay? 80 fat in a peanut butter sandwich, okay? Then you also have on here the sodium. Now the sodium to me is not that high on here. It's 125. It says 5% of your daily. So to me, that doesn't sound like a lot, um, but somebody else may have a different opinion but for that little bit of peanut butter that you can have if you only have two tablespoons it's five percent of what you're supposed to have per day now it does have two fiber and some, um, seven carbohydrates total now the good thing is the protein it has eight okay but the point I really want to make is you have to read labels you have to learn to read labels and again it's not something I was trying to see if I had one more thing in here let's do my um baked cheetos too right quick let's do my baked cheetos because y'all know i always talk about these baked cheetos so let's look at the calorie intake on that right quick hold on i'm gonna flip it so you can see it and then we'll talk about it so 140 calories not bad on weight watchers you can have like 34 of these let me show you the packaging that's the baked cheetos 50 percent less fat y'all know this is my favorite thing in the world so let's get into it though. So it says five fat and 34 pieces is a serving. So that's quite a bit, 34 pieces. So that's that's not too bad for 34 considering I'm gonna eat a whole bag of chips if I get my hands on some, okay? So that's not too bad. Also, we have one here, the sodium intake because my sister asked me about that. It's 10% for 240 milligrams. So 10% to me is not a lot for this to be my one treat. Whereas I might eat a whole bag of potato chips and you know how much sodium would be in that, correct? And then also on here is less than one sugar, two protein, and the total carbs is 20, okay? And this has a serving of eight, eight. So we have to learn to start reading the servings too because um, I know for a fact, I don't always look at the back of packages. I don't. But since I've been doing my journey, let me rephrase that. It was not my custom to always look at the back of packages. But now that I've been doing my journey, oh yeah, I'm reading, I'm checking. So I encourage you to just start reading. Just start reading. You'll be like, wow, I thought I was having a peanut butter sandwich, but you actually having four meals in one, okay? So today's tip is read the labels. Today is day number 29. We have one more day. One more day it has been an amazing month. We will do a, a check-in next Tuesday or Wednesday live on YouTube. So sign up for the email so you don't miss when I go live, okay? But the challenge results have been amazing so far, and I am just pleased. I'm just so pleased. 
So I'm gonna let you guys go. But sign up for emails. This is Healthy Life with Kimmy. I'm, I'm wishing you much success on your journey, okay? All right, until next time. Bye!